of alien cells starts to mutate and swell. Say hello to evolution. Just when it's out of control, the alien hater roll. So say goodbye to evolution. This hero team has got control of the scene. Okay, guys, get ready for round two. Human! Behold the evolutionary power of the genus. You cannot defeat us. You know, Scopes, white's just not a good color on you. It makes you look all washed out. Here. Try a little selenium blue. It'll bring out the color of your eyes. for a selenium upgrade. I'll get right on it. As soon as Dr. Reed brings me that spare chemistry kit. Doc, any chance of you getting here in the next, oh, I don't know, 2.5 seconds? No, but we have your position locked in. Oh, that's comforting. Pathetic ah. humans, when will you learn? You cannot defeat the genus. We shall rule! Sorry, Scopes, I wasn't paying attention. What came after poor, pathetic? Well, I never thought I'd say this, General Woodman, but boy, am I glad to see you. I wish I could say the same. I'm getting a little tired of bailing you out, Kane. Now get to work. Uh, you think I could interest you in a couple of tickets to a Cardinals game? 50 yard line? Trade? I'll just go. <laughs> Thanks, LT. Almost got it. King, behind you! Interfering human. You shall pay! Hurry up, King! It's devolution time! Hey, Gassy! Gassy, where are you, Gassy? Whoa! What's the matter, Scopes? Don't you want to behold the devolutionary powers of a new blue goo mix? I'm fine. It's just... It's just a nick. It's nothing to worry about. General! Sir! What's wrong? General! Gassy! Gassy! Where are you? Gassy! Gassy! Frozen solid! 
Scopes' bite was infected with a rare form of genus Venom that I've never seen before. It must be some new evolutionary trait. The Venom is spreading through the General's body at an alarming rate. If the genus Venom infects all of General Woodman's body, we'll lose him. So, there's no cure? Well, I didn't say that. The Venom is based on Scopes' DNA. That means that Scopes already has an immunity to its effects. If I can get a DNA sample from Scopes, with a little time, I should be able to create an anti-venom. Ira, I've run the calculations. There's not much time. The General has less than three hours. Doc, you already have samples of Scopes' DNA from our previous encounters, right? Thousands, but they're no good. I need to sample DNA from this specific evolution of Scopes. We have to get that sample. It's the only way we're gonna save the General's life. Dr. Kane! What about Gassy? Oh, that one's easy. Gassy should be done right about... Oh, good defrosted Gassy. I guess you are. I guess you are. I guess you are. Come on, people. Let's saddle up. We're going on a scope hunt. I put a heat tracer on scopes via the satellite. Don't worry. You won't get far. Ahead, 200 meters in closing. Hold on, Doc. Scopes is within range. Dr. Kane, look. It's Scopes. Hit it, Lieutenant. You got it, Doc. We need his DNA intact to make the anti-venom. Humans! Come, it is time for you to join us in our world. General, wherever Ira is, I'm sure he has everything under control. Uh, Scope shattered the top layer of polar ice. We must have fallen into some sort of natural ice cap. I'll run a heat signature scan to locate Scopes. This can't be right. According to the satellite link, the genus is all around us. We're completely surrounded. Um, Ira? Are ice caves normally this warm? Not usually, Harry. Doc, are ice caves normally this, uh, humid? Again, it's not typical. Uh, Dr. Kane, are the walls of ice caves normally this, uh, well, uh, purple and slimy? <laughs> Call me crazy, but something tells me that maybe this isn't an ice cavern after all. Genus? Wish they'd never seen us. <laughs> These guys are too easy. They're... Hey! Illegal use of... Whatever those things are. Oh! <laughs> Kiddo, how about a hand here? You got it, Dr. Kane. Thanks, kiddo. Now let's get out of here. But what about the genus, Dr. Kane? Don't worry. I'm taking care of it. I 
I'm linking into the ocean nav satellite. They'll triangulate our position and tell us where we are. And more importantly, what we're in. Uh, guys, we got some really bad news. We're inside a pod. Ira, let's devolve the whole place and get the heck out of here. We can't. There had better be a good reason why not. Because we need to capture scopes intact. That, and we're 40 meters under the surface of the Arctic Ocean. Without this pod around us, we'd be victims of hyperthermia in 20.35 seconds. Uh, that's a good reason. Ensign Martin, report to the engine room immediately. Aye, aye, sir. General Granger, General Woodman's condition is worsening. The genus Venom is more potent than anything we've seen before. The time has come to rein Scopes in and keep him under my control. We have to maintain our edge over the genus. Scopes is too much of an unpredictable element in my plans. Benedict, bring Scopes to me. And remember, I need him alive. Begin Operation Helix. Use the homing beacon to follow Kane's team. <laughs> They'll lead us right to Scopes. What about General Woodman? Without Scopes, he'll be... Woodman is... expendable. They all are. Just get me Scopes. Captain, there's been a report of an unauthorized torpedo tube firing. First mate, report. I've checked it, sir. It was an electrical malfunction on panel three. I'll have a tech fix it right away. Ugh, it's useless! The genus pod is clouding the signal. There's no way to track scopes. Uh, I don't think Gassy's gonna be too much help either. Everything's genus. We have to get to scopes fast for the general's sake. Well, I'm guessing Scopes didn't leave a trail of breadcrumbs. To find Scopes, we have to think like Scopes. We have to want to dominate the world? Not exactly. More like where would be the toughest place to capture Scopes, and also the hardest place for us to escape from. The center of the pod! Exactly! Come on, people, follow me! Scopes could do with cleaning this place up a little. And it smells terrible. Actually, Harry, huh? I think that's gassy. Quiet, we're here. The genus is amazing. Every stage of evolution is here in every conceivable form. Millions of years of evolution occurring in a matter of hours. This is the scientific motherload! It could hold the key to our own evolution! It's all right here! And look! The secrets of the genus! Even the origin of the genus's telepathic genetic memory! All I need is a little time. Genus pod and surrounded by vicious creatures. Now is not the time for research. People, time to devolve the genus. Much uglier, you pretty much cornered the market on ugly. Evolving into robots! No, I 
don't think that's the genus, kiddo. <laughs> for those coordinates and bring the vessel up to ramming speed. Aye, aye, sir. That's our ride. Come on. General, I brought someone to meet you. Ah, oh, come on, Scopes. You're gonna help us defeat the genus. All we need is a little anti-venom. Kane, you are in over your head. I'm not listening. Add a little of the Ira Kane genius. You cannot defeat the genus. Still not listening. And finally combine the DNA with selenium. That's it! One selenium, anti-genus, anti-venom. Human! You are a fool. We cannot be contained so easily. We are the genus. We shall populate the Earth! Not if we got anything to do about it. How are you guys doing? We are filling the torpedo with blue goo, Dr. Kane. Torpedo? Armed. Uh, it seems almost a shame to devolve that pod. There's so much we could learn. So much that... Ira, get it together! Right. Fire at will. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Captain. That's your line. Fire at will. Aye, aye, Captain. Hurry, Ira. We've got less than five minutes. So we destroyed your pod, foiled your attempt to take over the Earth, and you just helped save General Woodman's life. You're a hero. How do you feel? Ah! 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 Yep, couldn't have said it better myself. Stick around, Scopes. You're gonna help me with my research. Keep an eye on Scopes for me. If he moves or starts to change, hit him with a special mix of blue goo. Come on, people. We got a lot of genus cells to clean up. Thank you for all you've done, but there's only one thing. I'm blue! Hey, General, relax. It'll wear off in a week or two. Besides, it really brings out the color of your eyes. Captain, any word on how one of your exploration robots got into the pod? Not yet, but I'm going to get to the bottom of it. Ensign, what are you doing here? You're supposed to be guarding scopes. First mate Benedict relieved me, sir. He said it was your orders. I gave no such order! Captain, this is Chief of the Watch. One of the escape subs is missing. You're wasting time, Scopes. We need to stick to our plan. Yes, General Granger. We could not agree more. 